Today I'm going to be doing a quick video showing how to seal things in a straw. So here's a little example. I've got a coping saw blade and a little survival kit that I'm making that I sealed uh, inside of here so it won't go dull or anything. So you can see the ends are melted in there uh, on both sides. And I just put a little piece of tape labeling what's in it. And I'll be showing you how to do that today. So all you really need for it is you would need a straw, any color, any size, whatever you want. You need that, what you're going to seal into it, which I'm going to be doing another coping saw blade. So small saw blade, you just got to make sure that it is shorter than the length of your straw, which this is. And you'll need a pliers, preferably needle nose, and a lighter. Any kind of lighter will work. If it's a soft flame or a butane, like jet flame, either one will work. So to get started, what you want to do is take your straw and then grab those pliers, take it, and let's get a better angle here. Take it and kind of grab it so that it's right about there. And for doing this first end piece, you want to be pretty close to the end of the straw. So as you can see, pushing down right there. I'm just going to switch hands now, so it's a little bit easier, but so see that right there? Next, take your lighter. I'll just be using this Zippo lighter, and I'm going to turn it on. Just go over the end a couple times real fast. Let it cool down for a couple seconds. And then you should be able to touch it, take it off, it should be good. So as you can see right there, you got it on there pretty nicely. And if you're doing this with a normal soft flame, which is like standard lighter flame, you're going to want to be using it a little bit longer. And if you're using a jet flame like I just did, be careful because it will melt it pretty quickly. So it's something to be aware of when you're doing it. So now what we're going to do is take the coping saw blade slide it in there you can see it's in there and I'm just gonna pull out the little ridges there like that just because I like how it looks once more out like that and as you can see we got the end of the coping saw blade right about there so we got this much left and I don't want to have a ton of extra room in there so I'm gonna go about around half an inch past that and I'm going to kind of crease it right there so I know where. I'm going to take a pliers, take the little wire cutter on the pliers, and cut it. There you go. So now we're going to kind of repeat the process that we did earlier. We're going to grab the pliers like that with a little bit extra. And then grab your lighter. I'm just going to flip it around here. There we go. Grab lighter. Go over it a couple times. Uh, just like we did before. And it should be on there. Now if I take this off. There you go. You can see that's sealed in there. So if I'm shaking this at all, it stays in there. Works really well for keeping small things in there. And you can store really whatever you want in here as long as you can fit it. You can also use like shake straws which are a little bit larger for stuff. So you can fit string in there, you can fit like medicine or like any kind of ointments or whatever in there. Uh, and just kind of whatever you need. So hope this helps and uh, thank you everyone for watching. Please consider subscribing or liking the video if you enjoyed it. Have a good day. Goodbye.